Hey guys, Fluff here. Today we're going to talk about using multiple microphone setups on your guitar cabinet and phasing. But first, let's talk about why we need to phase microphones. This is my super technical speaker diagram. When you have one microphone, you don't have to worry about phasing because it's just listening to the speaker by itself. When you have multiple microphones, it is important that the sound wave reach the microphone's capsule at the same time. If they don't, then frequencies between the two microphones will cancel each other out. Put simply, phase can be thought of as the time difference between the two mics hearing the same waveform. For this example, I'm using a Sennheiser E609 and a Shure SM57, and I've placed them individually where I think they sound good. In your recording software, arm both tracks with both microphones on it and do a short series of tight percussive strums. What we are doing here is we're going to look at the waveforms in a recording software. We're going to zoom in very close to the waveforms and actually look at them to see where they're at in relation to each other. As you can see, the SM57 waveform is a little behind or late in hearing the signal. I am now going to move my SM57 forward so it can hear the waveform sooner and hopefully line up better with the Sennheiser. Once again, I will record some short percussive strums on the guitar. Once again, we're going to take a look at the waveforms of each microphone and see where they line up in relation to each other. This actually looks pretty good, and they will never be exactly aligned, but you want to get them as close as possible. At this point, I'm going to go ahead and record some test tracks in a mix and adjust the microphones in small increments if needed. Lastly, I want to stress to you guys, that there is no right or wrong here. You can move your microphones and have your microphones anywhere you'd like, and there is no absolute best position for any two mics, and you will never ever get them 100% phased. There is always technically a little bit of phase going on, but usually it's so small that you can't even hear it. In the old days, people simply used to just move mics around until they sounded good, and that's okay too. So, there, so again, there is no right or wrong here. This is just how I do it. And I got a lot of questions on how to use multiple mic setups on a guitar cab. So there you go. Thanks for watching.